Welcome to the homework for lesson seven. Lesson seven, grade two, module two. Get your name here first. Make sure you get that done so you don't forget it later. And we're going to use a centimeter ruler and paper clips <clears throat> to measure and compare lengths. So here's line one. First thing I'm going to do is measure it with a ruler and then me I'm going to measure it with a paper clip. And here's my ruler. This is a ruler. It doesn't have a zero line, so I have to use the end of the ruler and line that up with the end point of the line. And I can see it's almost exactly nine centimeters. So I'm going to call it nine. And yours may be shorter, a little bit shorter than nine, if the copy machine that printed your homework page scaled it down a little bit. That happens sometimes, so your measurements might not be exact. And you can see this ruler has little half halfway marks in between the centimeters. Don't write eight and a half centimeters. We don't use halves when we're um, measuring in centimeters. We're just the closest whole centimeter. No fractions of centimeters, please. All right, so we figured out that's nine centimeters. That's what we're going to call it. So line A, nine centimeters. Now paper clips, if you have more than one paper clip, it's going to be a lot better. But if you have only one, you can mark and move it. And we did that earlier in an earlier assignment. But I'm going to use these paper clips. There's one. If you have more than one, you can just put them end to end and see how many it takes. One, two, three. Three. And there's a little bit more left. I could probably it wouldn't even take it would take just like a little bit of another one. So it's not that much more than three. I'm gonna call it three paper clips. And I'm gonna move this down. And let me get these paper clips out of the way here now. Because we don't need those anymore. Because we have a question to answer. Get these out of the way. All right. So line Z, which is the one we just mentioned, uh, measured, uh, would, if we doubled it, would measure how many paper clips? So double the number of paper clips. That would be 3 doubled is 3 plus 3, which is 6. And for centimeters, we need to double those 9s, 9 plus 9. And that is, you know, that's if we're going to do make a 10, 9 is a 1 and an 8, right? We need that 1 to make a 10 here. So that's 10, 8, it's 18. <clears throat> and I'm going to move down to number 2. And we're doing the same thing again. We're going to measure it. We have two lines, line A and line B. We're going to do them both in paper clips and both in centimeters. So here we go. Centimeters, line A is 15 centimeters. I'm going to have to get this out of the way so I can write that. Line A is 15 centimeters. And then in centimeters, line B here is six, right, right there, the six. And as soon as I move this out of the way, I'll be able to write it there. Line B is six centimeters. And now I'm gonna get this, try and get this out of the way down here. And now I'm gonna measure in paper clips. Five, and there's a little bit left, but I couldn't put a whole one here. Like a whole nother paper clip is just going to be too much. 
that's not even half of another paper clip and that's kind of what you look for is if, if it's half or more then you're going to add another one but that's less than half of another one so there's line a that's how many paper clips it's one two three it's five paper clips and paper clips aren't an exact standard of measurement so <clears throat> It's always going to be kind of about, especially if you're marking and moving. Uh, and line B, we can measure that in paper clips too. Line B is the shorter line here. That's one, two. Really, there's a little bit left over there, but not hardly enough to worry about. So I'm going to call that line B two paper clips. All right, now we have some questions to answer. Line A is about how many paper clips long remember the units are really important here you got to read these carefully because we got to know we're always counting something in math and you got to pay attention to what it is you're counting and here they tell you we're counting paper clips so we're just looking at the paper clip measurements not the centimeter so line a and line b line a is longer but how much longer in paper clips it's five by the difference between five and two right so it's five minus two which is three it's three paper clips longer. And now we're looking at line B doubled, but this is in centimeters now. So now we're different units. So double line B in centimeters. That's line B is six. So to double it, it's six plus six. So line B doubled is 12. It's still shorter than line A. Line A is 15 centimeters, right? And you can count out the difference from 12 to 15, right? We could write this almost as an equation, but I'm just going to say the difference between 15 and 12, that's subtraction. When you're trying to find the difference between two numbers, 15 minus 12 is 3. So it's about 3 centimeters shorter. All right, and then uh, we're ready for the next page. So now we have to draw a, a line that is 9 centimeters long, another line below it that is 12 centimeters long. Got to use a ruler for this or some kind of straight edge. If you just try and draw a straight line by hand, it won't be straight and it won't come out right. So use a ruler to do it. And make sure that if you got one with centimeters and inches that you're looking at the, the right side of it the centimeter side then where the numbers are closer together I'm gonna have to draw a line using my technology here so there's the line that's nine centimeters I think that should be yep that's about right and then take my other line it's supposed to be 12 should be about right yep let me get this ruler out of the way the nine centimeter line that's a shorter one line label it F there and then the 12 centimeter line G <clears throat> and it looks like now we have to measure them in paper clips So line F, there's one, two, three paper clips for F and G. There's a little bit left over, but it's four is as close as we're going to get. Four. We don't measure in half paper clips either. All right. 
Let me just read some more questions and answer them. Line G is how many centimeters? Centimeters. Got to watch the units for this because if you use the wrong units, you're going to get the wrong numbers. So line G is how many centimeters longer than line F? Line G in centimeters. We knew that before we drew it, right? Uh, G is 12. And F was 9. So we have 12 minus 9. It's 3. You could count it up 9, 10, 11, 12. And that's three more numbers. 3 centimeters longer. Line F is how many paper clips shorter than line G? So line F is three paper clips. And line G was four paper clips. So the difference between those two is one. It's one shorter. And lines F and G um, in paper clips, how long are they together? So that would be 3 plus 4, which equals 7. 7 paper clips long. And I'm going to move my ruler again because it's going to be in the way. Let's move it way up here. And lines F and G in centimeters. In centimeters, it's 9 plus 12. Right, and if we're going to make a 10 here, because 10s are easier to add to. 12 is 1 and 11, so there's a 10. 10 and 11, 21. 21 centimeters long. All right, now let me get my let me get my lines and my paper clips out of here. I can get rid of my ruler too, I think. There. Okay, Jordan measured the length of a line with large large paper clips. These are the large ones. Uh, Jordan's a usually well, it could be a boy or a girl. His friend, so he's a boy, his friend measured the length of the same line with small paper clips. About how many paper clips did Jordan use? Remember, he used Jordan, right? And these are, his friend used the small ones, right? F for friend. So Jordan used one, two, three, he used four paper, four large paper clips. And small paper clips, his friend used one, two, three, four, five, six small paper clips. And why did his friend need more paper clips to measure the same line as Jordan. <clears throat> well, I'm, most second graders get this pretty quickly. That the, if you just look at it, the larger paper clips, you don't need as many because they're longer. So it doesn't take as many of them to cover the same distance. Smaller units, it takes more units. It takes more of them to cover the same distance. So Jordan's friend needed, why did he need more paper clips? Uh, Jordan's friend. And like most... Most of the time that these things are, you, you kind of know what to say, but you got to figure out how to say it. Jordan's friend needed more clips because, let's see if you can use the word unit. In there somewhere because smaller smaller units take more to Me 
measure then big units something like that you know you could just have something that says just anything that says it you know if you have smaller units you need more of them you have smaller paper clips you can see his friend had shorter paper clips and that's why I needed more and something like that something like that you don't have to copy my words exactly and uh, that's it we're done <laughs>